Welcome back for some more QA time. Today we've got Tori in the forum. And Tori asks about tear fluid and eyesight. I've noticed once I open my eyes, the new lubrication, the tears seem to be making my vision clearer temporarily. For example, my vision is crystal clear as soon as I open my eyes from the first blink. And then after a couple more blinks, my vision is slightly blurry again, the same distance away. Am I doing something wrong? How do you make sure that I'm achieving active focus and not just tear induced clarity? So here's the thing. Most of our eyes, for those of us that spend a lot of time up close and spend time inside air conditioned offices, our eyes are too dry. And this is partially because our blink rate is significantly reduced when we're in close-up focus, uh, as much as a five times reduction in how often we blink. And blinking delivers tear fluid to the front of our eye. So if you're blinking less, there's less tear fluid, and the tear fluid is another layer in front of your eye that is basically calculated in by how clear vision is achieved. So it's like that layer on the top changes the clarity of your eyesight. So when your eye is too dry, you're actually seeing less clearly than you do when your eye is properly lubricated. That's one thing that, that most people aren't aware of and that we discount a lot with our modern lifestyle and that we just simply don't notice when we're wearing glasses since glasses correct just for everything. So the close-up is an issue because of reduced blink rate and then our, our uh, ambient humidity tends to be really, really low when we're in air conditioned offices. So low humidity also means, you know, you're, you're, you're losing some tear fluid. Does that make sense? So those two things combined mean that what well, most of us tend to have somewhat dry eyes. And that means that our vision is somewhat affected. Now, when you start with active focus, first of all, your eyes tend to tear up because of the unusual stimulus, strain, sensation. It's just one of the things that happens to most of us when we first start is you just, you get, you, your eyes get a little teary. Um, that, that goes away once you find some balance in how much effort you put into the active focus. It's not something to worry about. It's something that just, just settles in basically. But you will notice that when you reduce the amount of time you spent close up in any one sitting, if you get outside more, your eyes tend to be less dry and your vision tends to be better. And conversely, when you have a really long close up indoor day, you notice that your eyes are more dry and you notice notably how your vision is less amazing. So if you go for a walk at the end of the day and you just spent eight hours indoors staring at a screen, you might notice that your eyes are a little bit dry and you might notice how you can't get the same clarity back. And then if you get a little bit more tear fluid, which you can kind of stimulate too, don't put anything in your eyes, but we'll talk about that another time. But then when you notice that your eyes are less dry, the like distant road signs and car license plates that you couldn't read when your eyes were dry, now you can read again. So to answer Tori's question, the, the excessive tear fluid will confuse things a little bit, but it's something that you just work through. It's not an issue. It's something that just passes as you get more into the habit of active focus. And the, a really nice side effect for a lot of people is your eyes in the long run tend to be less dry. Works out great if you wear contact lenses and it's just better for your eyes in general. That's the QA for today. I'll see you in the next one. Thank you.